the Secretary of State has indicated to me that he's focused on increasing transparency, accountability, and integrity in Oregon government, and uh, that the Secretary of State is a lean agency that provides excellent services to all Oregonians. And he wanted me to, to make the point that while SB 5536 standing alone is sufficient to meet all constitutional and statutory obligations, when combined with the reductions in House Bill 50, 5006, the Secretary is concerned that he will not have sufficient funds to meet the current obligations in the Elections Division. As such, he will be returning to the E-Board to request restoration of needed funding to ensure fair and secure elections. And I want to add to that, uh, Mr. Speaker, that we, we fund a lot of things through this process. We fund some things that are bad ideas or marginal ideas. We also fund some things that are good ideas and helpful things. And we also fund some things that are required to be funded by the Constitution. And in the case of the Secretary of State's office, we're funding some things that are absolutely required for just the operation of a state in general. And so this is a very important budget, and I, I recommend an I vote. Thank you.